Wow, has it really been 25 years since Batman the Animated Series first debuted on television? Crazy. I cannot believe it. I think to mark this occasion, we need to take a look at a couple items that were released while the show was still airing back in the 1990s. And these reflect the diversity of merchandise that you could find out there for this show. Gotham City is in trouble. Call for Batman. Gotham City is in trouble. Call for Batman. Gotham City is not in trouble when Batman is on the case and any little kid who has this alarm clock sitting by his bed and he's being woken up for school in the morning by this... Gotham City is in trouble. Call for Batman. <laughs> ...is really going to think he's being called into service and he's the Cape Crusader himself. This is a cool piece and I've been looking forward to showing this on Terrific TV Toys. I've had it um, for a long time since it originally was released. It's dated on the bottom, 1993. DC Comics Inc. Um, and I received it. I learned when I dug through my files a little bit because I date everything. Um, I received this on Christmas Day 1994, so about a year after it came out. And I do have this little pamphlet still that came with it. It is produced by Top Banana, the Batman talking illuminating alarm clock. And so you see all the instructions here. It's got very standard functionality. It shows you how to set the correct time, the date, how to set the alarm all of that and it really is um, a neat alarm clock and here um, it's got the time on the front and just like a digital watch of the time if there are those of you out there who remember digital watches that maybe some of us would wear before we started gluing ourselves to phones and other electronic devices um, this is just like the display of a digital watch and then it's got the set button the mode button on the top there's the demo that I pushed just now to see him um, to hear him talk and see the bat signal and then there's an alarm off button and a snooze button if you want those few extra minutes of sleep so yes standard functionality you've got the logo from the TV show on the front and you can see from this logo and from the appearance of Batman here this is from the show's early years since it debuted in 1992 because Batman has the design that he originally had on that series when he debuted. Um, so yeah, look at that special item. And the bat signal itself, it's projected out of <laughs> the bat signal device that you would see Commissioner Gordon use on the show. It is slightly adjustable. You can raise and lower it just a little bit so it changes the size of the projected image of the bat signal just a little bit on whatever surface like a wall or a ceiling and depending on how far away this is sitting from that surface if it's projected onto that bat signal is going to vary in intensity and size take a look at the back the action figure standing there yeah and on the back, you've got Top Bananas language here and Batman copyright DC Comics language. And then the battery door is here. Very easy to remove and replace the four AA batteries that it takes. So yeah, this was a wonderful gift from friends of mine back in the day that would always find me Batman merchandise of some kind, whether it was movie merchandise or merchandise from this animated series or any other TV shows. So I love it. And over the years, wherever I've lived, whatever house or apartment, I've always had this thing on display. That's why I had to dust it quite a bit. Never wanted to put this one in a box. So thanks for watching. Thanks for helping celebrate this anniversary of Batman the Animated Series. Next week, we'll take a look at that other item from the show to um, continue our anniversary celebration. So stay tuned.